So for the past six-ish months, I've been living inside of a camper that I built on the back of my truck. But I decided, because I'm a full-time college student, I decided it's better to be living in a van than a camper while going to college. So I sold my truck, took apart the camper, and bought a nice little van. So far, all I've done is just strip out all the seats, pull out the shag carpet, rip out the trim, pull out the VCR, a tape deck, stuff like that. And I'm almost ready to get to work. So this is as far as I've gotten so far. I just put the laminate flooring in. Um, this That's the seat belt, like, where the seat belt receiver goes in. It originally was sideways, but I'm gonna repurpose it so that I can work with my sofa bed that I'm gonna build. Now everything else I got, I fill up most of the bolt holes, but some of them I kept so that I could bolt down all the furniture, countertops, stove, stuff like that. And I still got a lot of work to do. My girlfriend's been helping me out a bunch. She's the one from episode two, if you haven't figured it out yet. But yeah, it's been good. She's up in Yellowstone right now, so I'm trying to, trying to figure out how to put these bolts. I got to screw in the top and the bottom at the same time. So I've, I've made some fun contraptions to get it all to work by myself.
That should be good. drawer and two small ones because of the wheel well on the other side and then we come around on this side and I'll talk about the countertop in a second but over here is gonna be so this is how I access the gray water from my sink and I just pull that out and empty that wherever or properly the really cool thing I like about it is if I close this door 
I can't open this anymore. I made it so that it catches on that little nub, so that seals off completely. And over here is more storage. I haven't screwed in the hinges yet, but this is more for when you're cooking, so you access it from over here. Will that one close okay? Yep, yeah, looks pretty good. So this is the countertop. It's Actually, bamboo hardwood flooring that I got at this used place. They had some leftover for really, really cheap. I paid like $10 for it, and it's only like $6 a square foot. But of course, I'll cut off the angle and stuff. And the sink I'm really excited about. I bought this stainless steel bowl, really cheap, just a mixing bowl. But I'm gonna cut out a circle and just inlay that so it's completely flush with the countertop.
that's about it for the original content I shot when I was making this. There's a couple of things I realized I didn't film while I was making. And I'll show you those real quick. I've been living in this for what? Over a year now, but I've been busy fighting wildfires and school, so I haven't had time to edit it. But, so I put the same siding on this side as I did on that other side. I put some feet on this. I don't know if I showed that or not. And this is just my cooler container. So I have my cooler in here. I keep my stuff in there. Right now I don't have anything in there because I've been trying to get this thing clean because it's been a mess for a while. Um, this is the countertop, sink. I use the sink a lot for storage. Uh, the bed. Oh, I added curtains up here and in the back. And I stained all the wood and put, re put the trim up. Uh, these curtains, they're just simple curtains that hook on up here. But especially when I close all the other curtains, it gets it decently dark. And yeah, they're just simple curtains. And then I use them sometimes when I'm driving and it's a mess back here. Uh, besides that, the only other thing I can think of that I'm thinking of doing is putting a middle console there for stores because it seems to get pretty messy right there. Um, besides that, uh, my girlfriend Mandy's about to finish up school. She's going to move in with me in the van. We'll see how it goes because we'll be traveling the West Coast for a couple months before we fly to South Asia and travel there. So it should be good. I really appreciate the people that have been watching me from the beginning and any new subscribers. I plan to keep making videos. I really want to make a teardrop trailer. I got a bunch of things I want to do. It's just if I find time to do it or not. So my goal is to keep going, keep going strong, stay busy, stay happy. But I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Bye.